And as we first told you in a breaking news alert, another person has died in a grain silo accident in Mitchell County. Investigators tell Fox 31 that 62-year-old Jackie McCook got caught in an auger Tuesday while loading seed into a semi-truck. An autopsy is being done to see if a medical condition caused McCook to fall in the auger. And a man is behind bars tonight after scamming people out of thousands of dollars. He tried to steal the identities of, of about 30 people. Fox 31's Cody Long connects you to the story. It all started when the Doherty County Sheriff's Office received a complaint in October. A gentleman came in and said that uh, he had had credit cards applied for in his name. They investigated and didn't get much information. Fast forward to March 7th. The department gets a phone call from an American Express investigator who said 12 credit cards were delivered and one was on the way to 307 Galwin Avenue in South Albany. We made contact with UPS and intercepted the package that was en route there. And then on Tuesday, uh, we obtained a search warrant and attempted a controlled delivery, which is when one of our people looking like a UPS driver, goes to that location and tries to deliver the package. Investigators were looking for 26-year-old Kevin Jackson. He's now been arrested and charged with 44 counts of identity fraud and three counts of financial transaction card theft. Investigators got a search warrant and found about 100 pieces of evidence at the home, all involving identity theft, credit card theft, and identity fraud. Uh, during the search, we found a lot of merchant cards where you can put stuff on them. So we know he's doing that. Investigators say Jackson was also involved in scams involving customers with Mediacom, AT&T, and Water, Gas, and Light. There have been at least 30 victims and could be more. The investigation continues and the Sheriff's Department needs your help if you know anything or have been a victim. Cody Long, Fox 31 News.